bang, bang. How's it going, everyone? I'm Filthy Gamer 555, and welcome back to more Five Nights at Wario's Origins. In the last episode, we did Night 4. It was very awesome, very scary. I had to do it with the light off in the level and or night, and it was very hard. I was very nervous. Now, I'm gonna let you guys in on a little bit of a secret here. I did attempt Night 5 already. I have to restart the recording because I had a little recording bump issue. Nothing too serious. I never could figure out how to do Night 5 anyway, but it was really awesome. The little phone call part, though, is very interesting because they throw another character in. I'm pleased with the character because it's a character I like a lot. So, yeah. Good evening, Wario. Wario here already. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, man. It's starting to get a little bit creepy in here, right? I mean, with the windy weather and the cloudy sky tonight, I've got some good and bad news for you, dude. Good news is, we've removed some boxes and other stuff in that machinery room behind the attic, so now you can look in that window to see on the other side. Not much to see in there, but one machine is connected to the camera power in the office, so... You can see the power drain in to give you a little insight of how much camera power you have left. Bad news... Though, well, the power ain't back. I hope you didn't throw away your flashlight, eh? But hold on, because there are more bad news in store for you. Um, avoid the basement at all costs, because I saw someone or something in the basement on the camera. And when I got back to it later, I swear it I'd come closer. Whenever you have time, check on the basement camera, alright? Maybe looking at it often will keep whatever is down there in check. Anyways, next week is a big week. So promise me to be careful tonight, Wario. We need you. I just figured out how to do this. Okay, thank you, phone guy. I never heard that one. The part about checking the camera, I was trying that, but it wasn't working, so maybe I have to hold it, or... Now I got confirmation, I was doing the right thing. You'll see soon enough, because trust me, this night is hard. I don't even know how long I've spent trying to do it, but it's hard. Trust me. You'll see. You'll see. Why do you want to see? Anyway, yes, Rosalina was the other character, which I found a bit odd because at first I was really confused cause when I first saw it because I'm like well she's never been part of the Five Nights at Wario stuff so I was confused as heck on why she was there I mean she's my favorite character so it's cool that she's in the game as long as she's not dead like the rest of them but I think she has something to do with the whole thing in general I don't know we'll see now Waluigi still lurks in this night and that's obviously a uh, obvious avoiding measure you gotta take. Yes, that sound is annoying, I agree. <laughs> It scared me the first time, like, really bad. Now that I've got a rough idea how to play this night, though, just make the assumption I'm gonna do not too bad. What? You're stalking me. Still stalking me, I see. Just gonna eat that. The hand's getting away. Uh oh, I took too long I'm running around there. This could kill me. Back up now. Check Mario to make sure he's in check. Uh, storage room. That's the thing, you gotta just. Don't let Mario sneak off. If you do, well, goodbye to your life, okay? Yeah. 
see, I, I let Mario get close now, and I'm killing myself for it. It's definitely hard, to say the least. Wow, I'm- it's just- Haluigi. He let Mar- or he got Mario some help. Mario got close. And you wanna know why he got close? Because I could- Ugh, Waluigi was everywhere! Okay, that did not happen the first time I attempted this. Did not. I don't press any details about that, though. I'm gonna run up there right now. See how you like that, Wario. Okay, okay, okay. So with Wario there... Everywhere I go, you're not letting me have time to. F this is so unbelievably hard. You guys don't even know. It's harder than it looks. I'm, I'm screwed. I'm dead. I'm dead. Mario's gonna get to me. See how I'm not checking on Mario? He's gonna find me now. See? If he's coming out of the camera, that's your last chance. You're done. Unless you can hold out, but... That would involve just staring Mario down, and he's never gonna go further back. Once he's there, you're not getting rid of him. He's there. Ah, oh, I forgot a lot about Mario. Close. It's only 3 a.m. I'm just gonna eat and head back. Oh. 
You know, Waluigi, you can just forget it. Get out of my life right now. Because I'm trying to live, but you're clearly trying to be my best friend. I'll get Mario a little out of my way. Cool down. Great. At least I checked on him right before that happened. Give me some time here. Not much, though. I could die for this. To be honest, this is my best attempt. But Mario is here now. Well, that's a new sound that I've never heard before and that I never will. I'm kinda scared. I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm freaking out in the inside of my head. Holy crap. Holy crap, I'm hearing sounds I don't want to ever hear again, okay? 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 Thank you. I'm nervous as heck. Go out of my life. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Give me back. Uh, oh my gosh! What was all those sounds? Someone was laughing at me. I don't even want to know who. I'm just freaking out on the inside of my heart, and my heart is beating on my chest. Several weeks later, Wario's was closed forever, as the paranormal events did not stop. My heart is beating out of my chest. Years later, after a newly built Wario where ink was burnt to the ground, Wario and Waluigi opened a third building. The brand new Wario's Fast Food Factory, which leads up to Five Nights at Wario's 1. Now we've- okay. We've got a night six. I will do it. But... Dang, this game... is tough. I don't really understand the whole thing with Rosalina there, what she was doing, but... It is an alternate Mario universe, I guess, but I don't know what she was doing. It's something to do with the spirits of them, but clearly triggers something. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't follow this story at all, but it, the game was great. I love the gameplay a lot. N like, Night 5? Holy crap, that was hard. I don't even want to see Night 5 again. But, I mean, if I'm going harder, which is Night 6, I'm going to technically be seeing it, but either way... If you liked it, show your support button and like button. This game is great. If you have not, if you want to play it, I did. I do have a link down in the description below to download the game to play it yourself. I should have said that at the beginning of the let's play, but I hope you can figure that out. So, yeah, I wanna stop playing some Five Nights at Wario's Origins today. I've been in time warp talk here. I've been playing this all day, or not all day, but for like the past two and a half hours, three hours. I've been just playing these games in. Uh, this game and it's great it's amazing i love this so yeah if you liked it show your and like button and i will see you guys in the next episode of five nights of wario's origins five nights of wario's origins <laughs> see you next time where wario will get you <laughs> anyway see ya <laughs>